it's Jennifer Escalera. Thank you so much for joining me today for Tune of Tuesday Sacred Sound Meditation Instructional Video. So in today's video, I'm going to show you what instruments I'll be using. And in order to listen to the meditation, you need to subscribe to my mailing list. And there's a link below this video, so make sure to click on it after you watch this video. All right, so let's get started. So I'm using one crystal bowl today, and it's an A flat. And this crystal bowl activates your third eye. So that helps you to get connected with your uh, intuition, your soul's purpose, and um, I'm also going to be using the rain stick. So this is a lovely instrument, as well as my ting shots for the beginning and ending. Okay, and then I'll be using the soul's journey cards to help guide me to create the intention of today's meditation and to see what we need to hear for our soul's journey. All right. <sighs> Success. I know that there is no greater goal than to love. Success. I know there I know that there is no greater goal than to love. Oh, that's so nice. <laughs> so this is a great card for us to connect with our soul and to remember that our soul's purpose is really to love. And there's a, a quality about your life that you can have when you come from a place of love and compassion. And that's really going to be your measure of your success. When you're thinking materials or how much stuff you have, um, that's more of the unhealthy ego. And so I think that this card is a great reminder for those of us who are getting trapped into the materials of the, or maybe the capitalism of you know, merchandise and, and having the greatest or the best things that everyone else has. And this is so interesting that it comes to me because I just watched a video um, the other day. It's called The Minimalist. I don't know if you've ever seen it, but it's a great video to watch. Um, but yeah, I mean, I think that this is an awesome um, way for you to connect with your soul and making sure that you are coming from a place of love and compassion and the more that you are able to express love and being loving the more you're going to receive back and vice versa let's say that you're a giver and you're not receiving enough love i want you to use today's meditation to focus on that energy of receiving love to, towards yourself. I'd love to hear how the meditation is working for you, so please comment below this video and share with us your experience, what you got out of today's meditation. I'd love to hear from you. Well, thanks again so much for joining us and I look forward to seeing you next week. All right, bye-bye.